record on repeat. He is a fan favorite in the country music arena, and we can surely see why. Nashville recording artist Easton Corbin uh, recently shared his newest single in, and a very exciting announcement, in the spotlight. Take a look. Hey stranger, how you been? Been a while, hasn't it? Saw the lime and tangeray. I could see nothing's changed. Said how's the West Coast? What brings you back home? Next thing I know, the band played on every dance to every song. Another one of those nights where we didn't want to leave. Kissing like you never left, got my heart back in a ray. Right on time, in the groove, you and me, like we didn't miss a beat. If it was quiet or it was loud, a couple people over the crowd, hell I couldn't tell, we were lost in ourselves, like the music never stopped, it was like the needle dropped, right where we lived on. Left on, no band played on every dance to every song. Another one of those nights where we didn't want to leave. Kissing like you never left, got my heart back in a wreck. Spinning under those lights like the record on repeat. Right on time, in the groove, you and me, like we didn't miss a beat. I am so happy to be talking to you again. It's been a few years, actually, since 2017. Um, I know so much has happened, so much has changed, and I really want to hear about your new single, Didn't Miss a Beat. Tell me more about it. Yeah, Didn't Miss a Beat. Uh, I think it's it's one of those songs that it's kind of fitting for the time. You know, everybody, you know, all this stuff going on, and kind of everybody wants to get kind of back to normal. And uh, so this song, I think, fits that. And, of course, it's about, you know, relationships and and picking up where you right where you left off and uh, I think that's kind of what we want to do in life today I think <laughs> yes I couldn't agree with you more um, I know we are all uh, now several months into it we're all like okay enough is enough let's get back to resuming some sort of normalcy um, I guess we might have to wait for that but in the meantime uh, congratulations you have a very exciting upcoming appearance on the Today Show, no less, right here on NBC. Uh, tell me more about it. It's, it's awesome. Uh, it's a little different this time due to all the circumstances. We actually uh, uh, we can't make it to New York, so we actually been re we've actually been rehearsing and stuff, getting ready, kind of getting the full band back together and, and back in the swing of things. So, um, you know, we'll have to do a little bit different this time, but that's okay. Absolutely. I've spoken to several musicians who say, you know, it's not the same, but, you know, during this time, we're just trying to make do and still make the music that people are so craving. And um, I like seeing 
you guys in your own elements, whether that's from your home or wherever it may be. I just, uh, I'll take it any way I can. And uh, you recently celebrated the 10 year anniversary of your debut single, uh, A Little More Country Than That. Um, what would you say really has changed the most since you realized that song was such a hit? You know, I don't know. I, I guess maybe the landscape of, of country music a little bit, you know, it, it's kind of, but, but it's like anything else. Anything always evolves. And I think as an artist, you know, you have to grow and, and be going to, you know, evolve with that. And, and for me, that's always kind of, you know, keeping one foot in the traditional and one foot in the modern and, and, and just kind of rolling that way. Yeah, well, you have a great sound. Congratulations. Uh, we so appreciate you uh, blessing our virtual stage. Hopefully we'll be back in the studio very soon, but in the meantime, best of luck. Yeah, thank you so much for having me. I appreciate it. So, so good. Guys, be sure to tune in to the Today Show on Thursday to watch Easton perform, or if you would just like to check out all of his music, go to EastonCorbin.com.